Okay guys, today we are going to work on writing and evaluating expressions. When a number or variable is multiplied several times, it is easier to write it with an exponent. An example of an exponential expression is seven to the third power or seven cubed. The bottom number seven is called the base number. The top number three is called the exponent or power. The exponential expression seven to the third power is read seven to the power of three or seven cubed or seven to the third. The expression can be simplified as follows. Seven to the third power is the same as seven times seven times seven, which equals 343. Let's take a look at some examples. Example one, simplify the following expression, five to the fourth power. Solution, five to the fourth power is the same as five times five times five times five, which equals 625. Example two, simplify the following expression, two to the 10th power. Solution, two to the 10th power is the same as two times 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 two, which equals 1024. Example three, simplify the following expression. One tenth raised to the third power. One tenth to the third power is the same as one tenth times one tenth times one tenth, which equals one one thousandth. Example four, three tenths to the fourth power equals three tenths times three tenths times three tenths times three tenths, which is 81 ten thousandths. Okay, write and evaluate expressions. Translating verbal descriptions into mathematical expressions can be helpful for problem solving. So, if you're given the phrase, add 21 and 32, then raise the sum to the fourth power, first add 21 and 32. Now raise the sum to the power. Put the sum of and in parentheses with the exponent on the outside. So the expression is 21 plus 32 raised to the fourth power. Now we always have to remember the order of operations. PEMDAS. Perform any calculations inside parentheses or brackets first. That's the P. E, simplify exponents from left to right. M and D, perform all multiplication and division in order from left to right. And then finally, the A and the S, perform all addition and subtraction in order from left to right. So for example one, if you have the expression 90 divided by three to the second power plus seven times three minus 12, we would do Exponents first, since there are no parentheses. Okay, so exponents first would be three to the second power, which means three times three, which is nine. Our new expression is 90 divided by nine plus seven times three minus 12. Okay, use PEMDAS just like a checklist. So we don't have any parentheses. We did our exponents. Now we're going to multiply and divide in order from left to right. So taking a look at this, expression here, we have division here. So we're going to do 90 divided by 9, which becomes 10. So our new expression is 10 plus 7 times 3 minus 12. I see some multiplication here, so I'm going to do that next. 7 times 3 becomes 21. And our new expression is 10 plus 21 minus 12. The last step is always to add and subtract from left to right. So I have some addition here. 10 plus 21 becomes 31. And then we have some subtraction. 31 minus 12 is 19. Let's take a look at example two. 90 divided by the quantity three to the second power minus six minus 12 minus two. What should we do first? Parentheses first. So in our parentheses, we have three to the second power minus six. 3 to the second power becomes 9. Everything else in the expression stayed the same. So we have 90 
divided by 9 minus 6 minus 12 minus 2. Now we will do our subtraction within our parentheses. So 9 minus 6 becomes 3, and 12 minus 2 becomes 10. So now we've done our exponents and our parentheses. What comes next? Multiply or divide from left to right. Taking a look at this problem, we don't have any multiplication, but we do have division. So 90 divided by 3 becomes 30. And then we have subtraction last. 30 minus 10 equals 20. What I'd like you to do now is watch these two videos on write and evaluate expressions and applying the order of operations when you have exponents. Please reach out if you have any questions.